hi guys welcome to family create hope you're all doing well so finally google has released a native whatsapp app for the watch uh, previously we couldn't use the app on the um, whatsapp on the watch uh, but now we can actually um, message and also voice message from the watch directly to anyone on whatsapp so yesterday uh, i signed up straight away as you can see here it says you are a tester so i've already signed up and registered and um, installed it on the pixel so today i'm going to update it on the um, watch 5 pro and see how that works because both of the watch are connected um, to my phone and show you how to set it all up uh, just to go through quickly with the um, whatsapp app for the watch you will see this update you can download from Google Play and sign up as a beta tester for the developer. If you do that, um, the test basically they will gather information and share it with the developer to help them improve the app. You do have the option to leave the um, test anytime you wish and then you can basically uninstall as you can see here because I've already installed it. And then uh, you can install the public version uh, back on your watch and then leave the program anytime you want. So just to be clear, you will have to update uh, your WhatsApp um, on your phone as well to have that connection between the phone and the watch in order to be um, in the program. So um, I'm just going to quickly show you on the Pixel watch that I've already installed and then try to update it on the Watch 5 Pro to show you the process if it allows me. Otherwise, I'll just go through the steps um, just to show you what I've done and then you can um, follow those steps. So here's the Google Pixel Watch. I've already um, installed the WhatsApp app on this watch. There we go. So here you can see the WhatsApp icon. I'm just going to click and go into, uh, and as you can see, these are the last contacts that I've had. And then you got the settings there. And then you can see there's security notification and then you have the logout option so as you can see you have more op option to load more if you have more conversations so if we go into security notification you can see you show the information here so um let's send a test and see how that works so let's send a voice message. Hi, this is a test. Okay. And let's see if that works. So let's check on this phone. And let's play the message. As you saw, the message was instant. So at the moment, I know we can't make video calls um, on WhatsApp or from the watch, but I just want to do a quick um, video on my, and send it and see if I can view the video on the watch. So let's do that and send it. So I've just um, sent the video that I just recorded to the WhatsApp. I'm just going to see if it's come through. And if I can play it, yep. So I've got the video, and you can see it says message unsupported. So that means, can you see? Message unsupported. So um, we can't view video messages. So if you get any videos sent to your WhatsApp, you can't actually see it. But it might be something in the future the developers um, improve, and we might be able to view it. So now I'm just going to quickly show you. Um, the 9 to 5 Google page basically shows um, the process and also where I've got the link to install the uh, beta version of the WhatsApp for my watch. So if you click on the link here, it will take you the page to the page that I showed you earlier. Um, and because I'm already a tester, um, basically I can't go through the process with you. But um, what I will do is update it because I haven't updated my 5 Pro and, and show you the process. So I'm going to show you now on the Watch 5 Pro um, 
because I've installed it on the phone and the both of the watches are connected to the phone, I actually automatically um, downloaded the WhatsApp on the 5 Pro. Um, but initially you would have to go to Google Play and download it. Here we go. And now, as you can see, it's giving me the option to update because it's already installed it on my watch from the update that I did on the phone. So here we go. As you can see, this is an update and it gives the option of uninstalling because I've already installed it on the um, phone. So here it is. This is what the new app is. Okay, so let's do an update. Here we go. And it's downloading now. Okay, so I'm assuming that the update is done on the watch. So let's go and have a look if it will allow me to send messages from the 5 Pro to anyone on WhatsApp. So let's check. There we go. We have a WhatsApp icon here. Okay, so it's come up with the screen to basically pair with the uh, phone. So this is the code they've given. Now I'll have to pair that with the phone. So let's do that. So um, on the phone, you would have got the same notification. So enter code to link device. So let's go in there. Are you trying to link a device on Wear OS device? Confirm. And it's asking for the pin. So we're putting in. Okay, so it's gone in. Here we go. Looks like your connection is slow. Okay, <laughs> so here we are. It's come through. So we can see now I've got the WhatsApp on this um, watch as well. So it's proven that we can have um, multiple WhatsApp on multiple devices like watches. So if you've got three or four watches, um, you can actually install WhatsApp on all of your watches. So I've now installed it on two of my watches. I'm, I may continue doing it on a few more others. I don't know, but anyway. So if we go into settings, you can see the same thing again, notification, security, logout. So you have the options to do what I showed you earlier on the Google Pixel watch. So let's go into the app itself and see if it goes from the app. There you go. It's all there. You can load more, all your contacts. So um, let's go in and see one of the conversation. Here we go. As you saw earlier, you can see the um, people's icon as well. And the last message I sent on the previous um, from the watch, the video, as you can see, is not supported. Let's do a quick test from this watch as well. See if it sends. There we go. Hi, this is a test. Send. Okay, sent. Let's hear the test. So here we go. Hi, this is a test. So instant messaging from both of the watches. So as you saw, um, the WhatsApp can work from multiple watches and it's fantastic. You can really um, use it on the go. Um, you don't have to get your phone out. Your watch is there basically. Um, and you can use it while on your hand rather than getting your phone out and trying to WhatsApp or read messages from your phone. People have been asking for WhatsApp on watches for a long time. So finally, it's great to have it on Wear OS. And Google have announced yesterday that um, by summer, all Wear OS watches will have uh, WhatsApp, including video calls and video messaging. So I'm really looking forward to that.
so although i've just shown you on the pixel watch and the uh, watch 5 pro it will work on any wear os watches so um if you have one try install it and let me know how you get on with it so if you find this video useful please do give it a like and support us by subscribing uh, if you have any comments do feel free to uh, leave it in the comment section and i'll get back to you as soon as possible thank you so much for watching until next time do take care bye bye